All right, all right, all right. It is morning time in Oklahoma City. It looks like night time, but it's morning time, trust me. All right, okay, so I'm at the Blue Beacon, okay? Blue Beacon, right over there, right over there, okay? You ever been in here? It says truck wash. I had to double take, make sure the sign said truck wash. And that's what it said. This is an RV. This is not a truck. And I'm guessing this guy in this little old Dodge Ram, it'll be broke down before you fast and you can shake a stick. That's just what happens in Dodge. What in the world are they doing at the Blue Beacon? A freaking RV and a pickup truck. RV pickup truck and this guy came out of his RV all looking at me when I drilled up like what am I doing here what am I doing here what are you doing here truck what are you doing here I'm here to get my mobile home wash my, my motor home I'm gonna get it washed not like it's look does it look really dirty to you guys? Oh my goodness. I mean, you can't go pull in to a daggum car wash. I've seen them. The ones that say, no trucks, but come here and wash your RV. Look at this guy. You'll be walking around. You're going to be staring at me, go looking. I'm looking. I'm looking at my RV. Look. I'm looking at my RV smoking my cigarette. Yep. Yep. It's there. It's there. Oh, my word. My goodness. What a waste of time. You come in here. You think you'll come here at 6 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> you think, hey. We'll go to the streak and bacon ain't gonna be hardening no people there. Be great. No, this guy wants to wash his Dodge, his Dodge Ram, and this guy wants to wash his RV, his motorhome. I'm big truck driver. I'm big truck driver. I'm going to the truck wash. I'm big truck driver. I'm slightly annoyed. 73.